Hi guys, coming to you with a quick video. Um, I'm just going to show you how you can uh, use the slice method and just make some uh, layered designs for your letters. So let's say you want to make a shirt and you just want to just give it a, you know, a nice little design. So let's bring in some text and I'm going to show you how to do that. I'm always wanting to use my name, but I'm going to use the word family. Nice, easy word. I'm stretch it out a little, make it big so you can see what I'm doing. And it doesn't have to be this size. I'm just doing this so you can see um, whatever size you choose, you can do it. But I'm just doing this so you can see it. So I'm going to duplicate this, bring that down here. And I'm just going to bring in a shape. Now I like to use a square because it has straight edges and let's block this and let's duplicate it all right let's center these together no I have no idea why I'm always trying to center something I'm trying to align it all right and then I'm gonna hit weld make it one piece now I'm going to center it all right and now I'm gonna slice so now I'm just gonna take those pieces out And we're gonna and you see now you have like a nice um, design here and you can screw this together so I don't keep moving it and there you have it and you can even you know now that you have it like this you could flatten it to make it one piece if you were going to say print and cut this now it's a uh, one piece and you can do that or you can unflatten it and then you know hit no fill turn it back ungroup it and we are back where we started at now it's red and you can do it like that I have OCD about this red don't know why but I just like this one this fiery one alright and then just gonna move this over here so I can show you one more way Alright, so I'm going to bring it in again. Alright, duplicate it. Bring this one down here. Alright, going to bring in a shape. Duplicate that. Send this to the back so I can see what I'm doing here. All right, that looks good to me. I'll slice. All right, gonna get rid of this piece. I get rid of that piece. Gonna bring this piece up. Gonna slice it one more time. All right, and now all right, we're gonna change the color. All right. 
it. So now just bring these pieces here and you have a nice Now you have a nice layered design here and you could kind of play now you can just play like musical chairs look you could take it out and you can have it like that and then you could just it would only just be three pieces if you use this piece then you would have it would be three pieces so now you could you know do it like that you can change this piece to white Put that in there and I mean it's just endless possibilities we can take that out we can take this piece out make this piece white and you can just play musical chairs with it see now you have that design put that back in there turn that one into that color and just move it around Center it, align it to the left. There you go. And there you go. So now, and like I said, you can flatten it. And then we can make it into that piece right there. And you can even bring in a shape and say you wanted to make, uh, you know, like a three see it maybe like a three by three keychain you just bring in you know you can do it with cardstock too I like to make uh, cardstock keychains bring in your little circle here slice it out now you got your circle you can turn this black make it a nice little cute little black background and then we will send this to the front all right bring that in there we'll lock this in then we just center it bam center it flatten it you got your nice little print and cut keychain right there don't have to use black I mean you can use whatever you want but I'm just you know just showing you how quickly you can make your own designs just by you know using some slice uh, using slice and some shapes all right so hope I haven't held you up for too long just wanted to show that to you guys and um, if you have any questions please be sure to leave it in the comments below don't forget to uh, share and subscribe and click that bell notification so that you can get notifications whenever I post up new videos. Have a beautiful day.